Hi, Steven here with Big Fish Audio with a quick look at what's new in the 1.2 update for Momentum. This update includes a new resizable GUI, numerous workflow improvements to our slice effects, which we'll look at in more detail in a moment, and additional bug fixes and DAW stability improvements. Okay, let's take a look at a few of the updates in more detail. As I mentioned, the GUI is now resizable. So laptop users rejoice, simply drag the corner of the GUI and reset the size to your liking. Okay, let's look at the slice effects workflow improvements. The first item we will look at is the overlay button. When activated, you will be able to see all available parameter settings in the wave viewer at the same time. For example, the delay slice effect has three editable parameters. So if you added some delay to a few slices using the send level, and you wanted to adjust either the delay time or feedback, click the overlay button to see all three parameter settings at the same time. Now we can see specific slices I had turned up the delay on while editing the time parameter. Another update you may have already noticed is while you edit any slice, you'll now see the value of the parameter change hovering next to your cursor as you edit. So for example, while you adjust the pitch of a slice, you'll see the value of that pitch adjust as you do it. We've also added grid lines to the Wave Viewer to make for an easier workflow when slice editing and setting loop start and end markers. Click over to the Slice Edit mode and you'll notice a new options drop-down menu. The Snap to Grid option, which is off by default, will snap your slice markers to the grid when you move or place new slices. The Snap Start End option will lock your start and end markers to the grid when moving them. This option is on by default, and we recommend keeping it on while creating new loop points to ensure your loop plays back properly with your DAW. Clicking the Reset Slices button will restore the original slice points of your sample when it was first loaded into Momentum. And lastly, Clear Slices will clear all slices on a loop at one time. And finally, we've created some more interactive features with your waveform viewer using the scroll wheel on your mouse. Dragging your scroll wheel up and down will zoom in and out on any sample. While holding shift on your keyboard, the scroll wheel can now be used to move left and right through your sample. And lastly, while holding the option or alt key on your keyboard, the scroll wheel can now be used to vertically zoom on any sample. So as you can see, we are committed to making momentum better and better. Let us know what you think in the comments and keep on making amazing music.